My name is Peter Johnson. I'm a journalist. A few days ago, I decided to investigate an old abandoned factory. Claims of supernatural activity and ghost sightings have been very prolific on the internet. I began my investigation thinking I could easily debunk this one. But I was wrong. I've already seen things that go against all known signs and everything I, I thought I knew. I've tried to stay away since my first encounter, but I cannot. It's like something is calling me from deep down that stairwell, like a voice in the dark. As I entered the abyss, the abyss also enters me. Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Play Stairs. My name's Crow and I found this game on Game Jolt and I'm not entirely sure what the game is about. There's a nice little intro there and I think I've seen maybe a game or two that's kind of like this game where you just kind of walk downstairs and random things happen as you walk down the stairs and um, you can't really control it. Like it's all random and you never really know what's going to happen and when. But as you can see... There's loads and loads and loads of stairs, and never any real end to them. Oh wait, I lied. There's an end to the stairs. I'm actually really excited to play this game. It was made on the uh, Unreal Development Kit, which is usually a good breath of fresh air to play a game on the Unreal Development Kit after you've played so many games that are on Unity. Uh, I thought this game, I don't know, I thought, just with the name Stairs, I thought it was going to have a lot to do with the stairs. I'll need the code to open it. Okay. This game has interesting atmosphere so far. It has pretty, pretty decent uh, voice acting, I'd say. However, I will take points away for giving us the, oh, I'm a journalist pitch. We've all heard that. Hmm. I'm not entirely sure what to expect. Four schematics and door codes. This could be very useful. 6141. Oh, I take a picture of it. Sweet. This changed a little bit, and by a little bit, I mean I'm scared. Help! Get in here! We're inside! Open the door! There's not going to be anyone in here. Yeah, I knew it. It's probably going to shut behind me too. I was just hearing voices. What's this? Oh, another thing with locked. You are here. TGS10. Hmm. It's been ages and no one's come down here yet. What are we going to do, guys? We just need to sit tight and wait. They'll come get us when they realize we're gone. They could even be outside the door right now, just minutes from getting it open. We just have to wait. I don't know how much more of this I can take. I say, don't we have anything left to eat? No, nothing. Except. Except. Uh, nothing. Jacob, go check the kitchen again. Samuel and me will check the other door. But what does that mean for me? I mean, what do what do what what do I do about that? Okay, I gotta find TGS 10, I believe. If I'm correct. 
There it is. Oh no? I could have sworn the map told me, like showed me like a path to TGS 10. I'm assuming these ones with, oh wait, what's this show? TGS 5, now it's showing. I'm confused. That one doesn't have a red light above it, so I assumed that was the one I was having to go into. I assumed incorrectly. Yet again, my assumptions have made me look like a fool. This one shows me to go into that room that's not any of the other ones. Okay, so obviously... I don't know, maybe those are like maps showing like what room I have to go into in order to unlock that room. Who knows? I gotta say, I like the atmosphere. I, ho I like the whole storytelling bit. Interesting things going on in this game. What's this, a fuse box? Looks like the exit door needs a fuse of its own to work. Oh, that's the exit door? Okay, so that's a fuse box. I have to find fuses. Eh. We need to do something, Samuel. What do you suggest, Isaac? There's nothing for us to do other than wait for help. And what if it doesn't come? What then, Samuel? What if help comes, but it's too late, and we've already started? That's not gonna happen. They're gonna burst through the door. Get us out of here. They have to. You know it could be days, even weeks, until they find us. And we have to stay alive till then. The both of us. What about Jim? If we're going to live, we need to eat, and the only thing left to eat is Jacob. Wow. Well, uh, that's pretty brutal, but I mean, I suppose in the situation... Oh wait, did I actually flip that? Can I flip all of them? Oh, no. Oh, wait. Okay, this opens one door at a time, and it shows me which door is open. For some reason, I can't flip either of these two. I'm assuming maybe they're broken, or maybe I'll unlock them from somewhere else. I don't know. I'll unlock the one closest to me, which is 07. It should be right outside, according to that map. It's 06. I had to learn this map a little bit better. What's that? 08? So, where the hell is 07? Oh, right here. Good junk. Sweet. What did that do for me? Got me over here. I can go down this hallway. There's like whispering noises I hear. That's just like, like just showing me or telling me that they're about to tell me a bit of the story. So I don't know if this game's actually supposed to be horror or if it's like supposed to be like a narrative. I'm not sure. But either way, it's got me on the edge. I'll need something to open the valve. Okay, so I need to find like a valve handle. Story time. Did you find anything, Jacob? There's nothing here. I'm starting to think we aren't getting out of this place. Did you guys find anything? We found something. At least until rescue gets here. Oh, really? That's great. What is it? Do, do you have it with you? We have it right here. Isaac, that's just a knife. Close your eyes, Jacob. And this whole nightmare will soon be over. Nightmare indeed. To let him talk him into eating him. Pretty fucked up stuff. But you know what? Times of desperation may cause people to do crazy shit. And there's a, a loose handle. valve handle. Should be a vault to use it on somewhere. Yeah, the one we walked into. Story! This is so fucked up. How the fuck could we do this? We killed Jacob. And we ate him. Isaac isn't going to stop. Unless I stop him. Unless I kill him. So I can live. I have to live. Isaac has to die. People are getting a little crazy now. Alright, so that's 05. Then 08 is over there. Oh, 08 isn't that far away from me either. Maybe I should have just opened 08 first. Because 08's right there. 05 is... 
Not sure. I'll find it afterwards. Right now. Oh, wait. That's 06. For right now, I'll open 08 and go to it since it's right here. Because I already have the evolve handle to open up the other door. The first one I went into, which I think was 06. Oh, shit. It has to be done. Jacob was weak. Feast and we have to live no matter what. I have to live no matter what. I have to live. And Samuel has to die. Okay, then. Not me, though, right? Because... I'm not a part of this. Where's the bones of these guys if they were trapped down here? Maybe they're in one of the other rooms I haven't found yet. I don't know. But this room seems like it was only for that bit of story and wasn't actually going to help me in any way. So I will open up. Oh, no, 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 no. Where's 05? Over here. That's 06. Damn it. 05 is the only room I haven't went into besides the one that requires the valve handle. So I've got to find room 05. I'm just not sure where 05 is. Oh, there it is. Sweet. Okay, this is like a kitchen type area. I imagine a fuse has to be in one of these rooms, or either the maybe the room with the that the handle goes to. What about here? Oh nine. I can't get into that way unless I light it up, which I cannot light up more than one room at once. At least not from this location. Maybe I'll be able to light them up from another location. Not sure. Now, what room did I go into first? Was it 07 or 06? I think it was 07. This is the right way, right? It takes me to the room that requires the valve handle. I believe this is, yeah, this is the right way. There it is. Put the valve handle on here. Squeak. And in here it lies. Perhaps I can use this to turn on the power and open some doors. Maybe. I'm not exactly sure what it is. You'd think that the guys that were here before would have been able to figure this all out. I'm not exactly sure what I just found, but I'm assuming it's going to be useful somehow. Probably going to regret saying this, as I always do, but it doesn't seem like there's anything scaring me. These just electronics yet. are practically ancient. I hope they still work. Okay, so what did that do? Did it just give me access to these two doors? Is that what it did? Ten and nine. Okay, so I can actually open nine now. Which, if I open um, gate five. And then also gate 9 at the same time. I can go through there. And then also gate 10, which is just around the corner, I believe. Yeah, it's not that far. I have, wait, why does it say I have 5, 9, and 10? Can, I can open both of these at once? That's cool. Well, I might as well go check out 10 since that's an isolated room. I believe that's down here. And then I'll go back through 5 and then through 9. Alright, this is nice. I'm sure I'll get another bit of story from this. Nothing else. Not even a cheap scare. I thought maybe there would be something in this door. Maybe there was, like, during that little noise that occurred, but I just wasn't looking because I was actually trying to find something useful. Don't know. I'm going to go through 5 and then through 9 and see where that takes me because I've opened all the doors now. I'm assuming this might lead toward the end of the game or something like that. Don't know. Or at least might lead to a fuse because that's what I seem to be looking for is a fuse. Can't go that way. Oh shit. That does not look good. You are me, Samuel. And I'm not gonna die for you. Hello? Anyone there? Better run, Samuel. Because I'm coming. Oh shit. Um, I'm not Samuel. So, uh, maybe you don't kill me? Because, you know, I'd rather not. But I guess I'm going in here. Um, I'm not Samuel. I'm not Samuel. I'm not Samuel. Samuel, am I not? Did you stop chasing me? I don't know. Don't know if I want to stop and find out. Oh, nope. It doesn't sound like you did. Still running. 
and still not Samuel, might I add. Okay, bathroom. Oh, shit. Bathroom is my only hope. Oh, fuck. I found a pipe. What good does that do me? Die. Samuel. Did I just kill someone? Can't tell what just happened. Assuming maybe some of these bathroom stalls that I can't open might contain the remains of some of these people. I just picked up a pipe. Oh, that door's opening on its own. There was a few things on the way here that I didn't really take note of because I was trying to run for my life. Because I'm not Samuel. There's a fuse here I can take. Yes! This, this could get me out of here. There's several fuses. Oh, shit. Found the remains! Definitely human remains. Okay. That's not a good sound. That is not a good sound. That is a bad sound. That is the sound of nightmare. I don't know if you can hear me. Or if you even care. But I'm begging you to end this. this nightmare. And take me out of here. I would do anything, just make it stop. Okay, I don't know what you're asking from me, man. Shit, shit, fuck, no. Oh, this is a Not bad now, time damn for my it. flashlight to go out. Turn your flashlight. Peter, stay calm. Camera flash. No. I can use the camera flash. No, are you shitting me? I've got to take pictures. You're kidding me. Really? This is freaking awesome, but it is scary as shit at the same time. I seriously have to go through here using a camera flash to light my way? Are you kidding me? Holy freaking tits. I don't even know, like, I, I have an, a general idea of where I'm going, but no one is coming. Well, I mean, that's kind of the idea. That's why I'm getting the hell out of here. Oh shit, fuck you, man! What the hell? Alright, I need to find an exit. That wasn't cool. I just freaked my dog out. I freaked myself out. I don't know which way. I don't know which way to go. I think it might be this way. I don't really want to walk into darkness. But I think this is the way to the exit. Yes, this is definitely the way to the exit. Get me the hell out of here. Oh god, why am I stopping? Why am I stopping? Why would you stop? I'm in here! Can you hear me? We can hear you! Are you okay? Can you open the door? Stand back! We're coming in! Oh, am I out of there? I didn't even Jesus need the fuse. Jesus Christ! Are you okay, sir? Wait. Oh, that was them finding the one guy. Never mind. I thought that was them finding me. Oh, there's more stairs? Are you kidding me? There's more? Where do I go? Do I go down? I guess I go down. I assume that's what I do. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Do I go down? Oh, no. It, like, stops there. It was like a, a concrete slab. Like, it didn't want to restrict you, so it gave you the option to go down, but the, the developer secretly was like, oh, God, I hope they don't go down. Who in their right mind would go down? Oh, wait. I can't flash. I can't flash anyone. My life is over. All right. After this ordeal, I took some time to look up the case of Jacob Donner, Isaac Eddy, and Samuel Reed. Samuel survived his friends and was rescued, but he brought something with him from the darkness. Soon after he regained his freedom, Samuel Reed kidnapped and murdered an eight-year-old boy, took his body down to the same shelter, and ate him. The authorities found him, and he was sent to a mental hospital, where he still remains. <laughs> this was five years ago. Wow. I wonder, like, if that was based on a true story or something, because that is some sadistic shit. I gotta say that that scare that happened at the end there, so unexpected, it might have been one of the biggest scares of my life. I mean, I've been frightened before, but geez, that, I, I'd be fucking line if that didn't catch me off guard. Whew. 
this is a good game. I'm pretty sure I've seen a few things saying that this was very early in development still. So yeah, see, thanks for playtesting this demo. It's not done yet. Boy, it needs to be because holy, oh my god, this game has loads of potential. If that was only the first level, I cannot wait to see more. My god, this game is going to be awesome. Whew. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe on the video if you feel the need to do so. You can leave me any types of criticisms in the comment section below. So until next time, guys, take it easy.